Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Jess and today I thought I'd bring you along with my day. So, I've not been very well over the last couple of days. Um, today, I feel like I look and I sound worse than I am. I feel okay. I have taken some Lensip, lots of uh, fluids, etc. And yeah, we're gonna get through this. It's just a cold. <laughs> Um, I know I'm known for being a little bit dramatic about these things. Anyway, today I've just got some um, shopping to do this morning and um, I'm actually meeting up with Demi for lunch. We're going to this nice little restaurant um, on the coastal front, um, which is supposed to have some nice views. However, the weather at the minute is pretty lousy, so I'm not sure how nice the views will be, but never mind. So yeah, and then I've, I've also, I'm also going to start filming today a declutter video, which I'm hoping should be up by Sunday. If it's not, it'll be up Tuesday. But yeah, I'm going to start filming that today because my house, I, I keep getting like little urges to do it, but I'm not acting on it and I need to act on it. So yeah, we're going to declutter the house, really have a nice kind of, I, I don't want to say minimalistic feel to it, but... A lot more minimal than it currently is. So let's crack on with the day. Um, I've just had some coffee this morning, not really feeling breakfast. Um, do you ever just feel like sometimes you wake up and you just and you still feel full from the meal you had the night before? Well, that's how I'm feeling this morning. So I'm not having any breakfast, um, but I am meeting up for lunch with Demi, so I'll be having something there. It's currently uh, 20 past 11. Um, I'm meeting up with her at 12.30. So I'm going to quickly pop to Superdrug because I just need to get some false lashes and um, I think I'm going to go to B&M because I want to get like, do you know one of those toothbrush holder things? Um, so I'm going to get one of them uh, to put like my toothbrush and stuff in just because it kind of, I don't know, my sink doesn't feel right with it the way it is. So we're going to do that. I hope you're having a lovely day. I hope you're looking a lot better than I currently am. I look like I've been run over. Let's forget about that. So very quickly before I go meet Demi, um, I ended up at Silverlink, which has a Wilco and a boot. Um, and I picked up my things from here. So let me show you what I got. Um, so the lashes. So I ended up picking up some foam mink wispies, um, a little two pack there, which I thought looked quite nice. Um, so I've got them ones. Uh, I picked up a new lip balm because I was running out of my last one and these are absolutely, these are my absolute favourite um, and I'm going to put on now because I need a bit of colour on my lip and I love them because they've got like a little tint of um, colour in them. As you can see my lips are dull um, and this is probably what I use the most um, when I'm like going out and about I don't really bother with like lipsticks lip glosses or anything like that unless I'm like going out out but on a day-to-day -day basis this is what I use and you can see the difference already I feel like it just adds a little bit of like very subtle color back into your face especially when I'm feeling especially when I'm not very well um, I also picked up a three evolution air freshener refill now it kind of dawned on me the other day right and i feel so irresponsible for this but all these problems that i've been having with billy it didn't occur to me that my um air freshener things might be causing some irritation um so i unplugged all of them i mean it might not be that because he seems to be doing very well on his medication that he's currently on um, but I thought I would try on, like, one which is definitely pet safe. So, I mean, it just smells like any other kind of thing. Um, yeah, I thought I'd just try that just to see if it makes any difference whatsoever because I would do literally anything to prevent Billy from over-grooming. And I will feel so bad 
if this was the problem i can't believe it um they've been unplugged for a couple of days now but yeah um then i also picked up like a it's like a bathroom toothbrush holder because well, this is what i wanted it was six pounds and i thought it was quite good because it's got like the two sections so you can put the toothbrush on one side and then like toothpaste and other things in the other um but it's quite like solid so i feel like i'm gonna have to like secure this down otherwise billy's gonna go into the bathroom knock it off this knock it into the sink and probably break it so i'm gonna have to secure this down one way or another um i also picked up oh i got some new tea lights so because i'm obsessed with like um having like little tea lights and stuff on i got these ones they're unscented you get 100 in the pack they burn for three and a half hours and i think they were three pounds 75 which i didn't think was too bad at all for 100 tea lights um and yeah that's everything that i got so there's my little mini haul put everything back so yeah so i'm gonna go and meet demi for lunch now i don't think that i'm being that selfish right now you said yourself you'd be breaking your vow I can understand you're tired of this town And I'm not saying that we have to settle down now Just remember this We could have been stardust Same world but without us Something made us Find each other out there Made us realize We're more than just stardust Ignore this fact if you must Okay, I'm back now from Ooh, let me put you up Um Ooh, oh my goodness This tripod I'm back now from my lunch and coffee with Demi. I have poured myself another coffee. Do you know, my coffee intake recently has been horrendous. Um, I really need to sort it out. Um, so I think I'm gonna try and say one coffee on the mornings and then that's it, unless I'm meeting someone for coffee because at the minute, although to be fair, I do feel like at the minute my coffee intake is helping me get through this illness. So, maybe when i'm feeling a little bit better it might subside my coffee cravings but at the minute i'm just like coffee all day every day which isn't great but never mind had a really nice um chat with demi today and we've just been discussing like our health and fitness goals and like what we're doing and this that and the other and i've got to say demi is doing so well with hers you can really notice a difference and we were just talking about like things that like hold us back and our limitations and i kind of identified that like i think because demi said that she has pretty much nailed it with the food now um but she's struggling with like the gym kind of side of things um whereas me i'm like the opposite like with the gym i'm absolutely fine but it's the food that's letting me down um so we've just kind of been discuss discussing that and like what we're going to try and just coming up with whatever um so yeah it was a really nice really nice coffee and lunch i don't know if i showed you these actually i bought these flowers right from ikea right these are artificial flowers and you can buy them individually so this so this vase is from Ikea as well. I don't think it was too expensive, I can't remember. Um, and I did have some real flowers in there. But then once it was, once the flowers died, I was like, I really want to have just like a centerpiece of flowers on my table. So I came across these, um, which are like peonies. And you do just buy them individually. I think that they're not even that expensive either. So I bought some of them. And I think the good thing is that the... <laughs> The department that the flowers were in was literally like right next to where the vase was so i kind of could measure how many i wanted but i just think they look really pretty just on the just in the middle of my uh my table um but yes i'm gonna go and put a load of washing on because i need to do some washing i've got quite a bit of uh bedding to do um do you know what? when it comes to washing right i don't care about like putting things in the washing machine and you know this that and the other it's the hanging up the hanging up is just oh i hate it but yeah 
And I've also worked out, by the way, so the other day I put something on about how I thought that my electric dryer had burned a hole in my pyjamas. I've come to the conclusion that I don't think that's actually what happened. Um, I kind of, a few people messaged me, a few people commented saying that they, it, they thought it looked more like a tear than a burn hole. So um, it, I'm guessing that it's torn in the washing machine drum or whatever. Um, cause when I did look at the hole again, I was like, actually it's like frayed rather than like, cause I feel like a burn is a very kind of like crisp hole, isn't it? Um, so I feel like it has torn. So I'm, I'm a little bit less worried about my electric dryer burn, potentially burning my house down now. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm going to have this coffee and then, um, start a lot of washing, I think, and just do some general household chores, household chores. And then I'm going to start my declutter video, I think. Yeah, I need to really like egg, my, egg myself on for that because I get like random bursts of energy where I'm like, yeah, I want to declutter and then it disappears. So, yeah. Two things. I am currently sat editing um, and my washing machine started doing something very weird the other day, which I thought was a one-off, but I've just heard it from upstairs in my bedroom. Let me show you a clip of what it, sound it was making um, the other day, which kind of confirms why I think that my clothes have ripped and why I have a feeling that everything that is currently in that washing machine is probably ripped to shreds. So yeah. I don't know, why has that started happening? Why? 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 I can't afford a new washing machine right now. Also, and another thing, um, you might notice that my door is closed, right? Billy has been locked out. He is on bad terms right now because in the back of my computer is where I plug in my memory card to upload all the um, footage for my videos. And um, Billy has now taken a liking to chewing things including my memory cards. This is what my memory card looks like. All of the footage on this memory card is now gone. Gone, kaput. Uh, luckily, luckily all the footage was like already on my computer and uploaded to YouTube. So it doesn't really matter in terms of footage. Just deep breaths, Jess, deep breaths. I don't know what to do. Um, yeah, so lucky me. Anyway, I'm going to carry on editing, um, pretend that never happened. Yeah, and carry on. <laughs> right, so washing is now done and hung up, ready to go. So far, I can't see any rips. <laughs> so, fingers crossed. I'm going to show that video to my dad because obviously my dad can fix everything um, and see what he says about it. But yeah, I am just going to end this video here because it's just getting on and I'm not really doing anything else this evening. So um, I'm just going to run this video off here. I hope that you've enjoyed it. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. Go hit the subscribe button, all that good stuff. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Baby, let me love you, let me love you, let me love you, let me love you.